Hey guys, welcome back to another video on the Railroad Empire. Today we're going to be taking this non-lighted passenger car and we're going to make it lighted. The passenger car will be powered off of track power and not batteries. So it'll look pretty cool when it's done. You're going to need three working Christmas lights. I got these off of a half dead strand, so yeah. You're going to need four things of pipe, uh, copper piping, and some wire. I've got this silver wire there. So you're also going to need a soldering iron, and I think that's about it. Okay, so now you can see that I have it soldered up there. So I have my wire going from this copper tubing to this copper tubing. So then after you have those two done, you're going to go ahead and just attach, just attach one more right there, and the other one is just going to lead to nothing. So your finished product will look like that. And another thing you're gonna need is a wheel that's insulated on one side and metal on the other side. So you're gonna go ahead and take those off and put them, the axles, through your copper tube. So you're gonna take your wheels, you're gonna pull them apart. So then you have one wheel and an axle and then your wheel. So then you're gonna take your wheels and you're gonna feed it through the tube. And then you're going to put your wheel back on. And then you need to make sure that it's the right spacing. So just take your other wheel before you put it on and check that they're the right spacing, which in my case, I nailed it perfectly to the right spacing. And then you're going to do the same thing with this wheel. Sometimes it can be pretty hard to get apart, but and there's that one. So now that I have both of the wheels on, you're going to go ahead and put them back on there. Now that I've got the wheels on, we're going to feed this wire down that hole there. That hole was actually where a screw went to hold on the weights inside, so I just took off the weights, and I'm just reusing the hole for the wire to go through. So we're going to shove that in into the hole, flip it over. and pull it out there. Okay, so... Okay, so that. after you have that done on both sides, you need to take your three Christmas lights, or however many lights you want in your thing, and solder them you all together. You've got those soldered together. You can see my solder joint there and there. You're actually going to go ahead and attach some more wire there. Okay, so after you've got your other wires soldered on the ends there, you're going to go ahead and attach it to the top of your body. You can choose your own method, glue, tape. I'm going to use tape because I don't have my hot glue gun with me. But, so this yeah. is actually the one that I'm going to be putting in a different car. I actually made this one here for the baggage car so that the white wire runs across that part so that there's not a green light sitting there. So I'm going to go ahead and get that taped in and then I will show you what to do. So after that's all taped in there, then we're going to go ahead and connect this here wire to that one. After that one, you got to do that one and then you put the top on and you should be good to go. Okay, so you guys can see after all that hard work it paid off. It's all lighted up, seats are inside, and yeah, it glitches a bit on this track, but this track is really dirty, haven't cleaned it in a long time. My upstairs track around the train tree, which you guys will see a video soon come out about that, which hopefully will be really cool. You guys will see that it's pretty steady and it's pretty good, and I'll run it with all the other lighted cars that I have. So thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time on the Railroad Empire.